I'm Jessica Chester and I'm from Fillsburg, Kansas. I do the breakaway and the team roping. I'm Keely Vaughn, I'm from Merrill, Oregon, and I break away team rope and run barrels. This is Keely in the box. I'm 23 years old. I'm originally from Klamath Falls, Oregon. Um, my dad cowboyed his whole life and rode bareback horses, and he's now in the Marine Corps. And my mom's from Southern California, and she's a barrel racer. My favorite memory was probably Silver State in 2015 when I got my dad to push my calf to win and go around. What I love about it is the camaraderie between like fellow competitors. Like it's not a team event, it's not a team sport, but I'm gonna push my traveling partner as hard as she pushes me back and we're gonna want each other to do just as good as ourselves. What it does for the animals that we love, it, upper, it ups the market value on them. It brings money to a lot of people that need it. And these animals try so hard for us and it's so cool to be able to showcase them and show what they're worth and what they mean to us and give them uh, something to live for, go to work for every day. I think coming from the West Coast, we fight a battle every day, trying to keep our living alive and show people what it does for us. And I just hope they realize that if these horses lose these jobs, um, they're gonna go pretty much go and not have lives. And can you imagine sitting on your couch and just eating and getting fat all day and not having a purpose? and all it's gonna do is lower their worth and start to starve them out. And it's gonna kill a lot and it's gonna up all of our grocery prices and we're gonna lose a lot of things. And I think people need to see that and realize that these horses aren't tools to us or our family. And I've had this one behind me since she's a two year old and the money and the work that I've put into her to get her to where she's at. It is, I've cried good and bad tears over it and I'd be lost without them and she's more important to me than a lot of people, so. <laughs> I'm Jessica Chester, and I'm from Phillipsburg, Kansas. Um, I have been in rodeo my whole life. My dad's always done it. Um, my history on it is we've always just rodeoed. My sisters and I both, all three rodeoed, and everything has um, fallen together with that. And uh, we raised a few cows, not very many, and just always had horses and always have rodeoed. Right now I have a, I own and run some cows with my husband and uh, we run about a hundred head and we have, we train rope and horses for a living and, and I'm also on the crop side. My life is, <laughs> it's not gravy every day. It's a lot of hard work. It's a lot of dedication. You have to want it and you have to have a way to strive for it. We, uh, we run the cows to help put food on the table for everybody and nobody takes in consideration where their groceries come from every day. Um, they just think that it just automatically appears out of the sky and it's not that way. We work every day, we practice every day, we put in a lot of hours, we get a lot less sleep than everybody else, but that's part of the deal that we love. We don't go on a lot of sleep. We travel all over. The rodeo industry is going crazy. There's a lot of breakaway opportunities out there and we're trying to take value in all of that. These people are trying to put rodeos on for us and uh, my traveling partner and I, we try to go everywhere. Um, money's tight and you just gotta do what you can do. I'm not saying that the city life isn't the great life either. You guys do a lot of good things for us too especially the little girls that try to come over and pet your horse or pet your ponies or I just want to see you or give you big hugs. Like that's the stuff that we strive for every day. We just want everybody to know that everybody works just as hard. I don't care if you have a corporate job or not, everybody works at it. And that's what the world's about.